Hey guys, it's Jab back with another Chilling Rain box opening. Honestly, my pulls from this set have been pretty poor so far. I think I got like one secret rare in the last four boxes and very few full arts. So definitely a rough set in terms of pulls, but I still really enjoy it. The artwork's amazing. Also, these booster boxes just look sick. But yeah, if you want to support the channel, click the eBay link in the description below. And any purchase you make, it doesn't have to be from my store, I get a small kickback. And that helps me continue making these videos, so let's get into it. Dini Viper. Clarion Slowpoke Reverse Hollow. Alright, I actually just went and washed my hands because I had like the the white powder stuff from the Pokeball logos on the box wrapper. That stuff like gets everywhere if you're not careful. Reverse Hollow Intellion. And do the Hollow still have the same print issue? Yeah. So you see, we have every Hollow I've opened from this case so far has had um, creases on it. Really, really annoying. I'm gonna have to find replacements for all of these for my master set. So I don't wanna collect crease cards. And we have a Celebi V. Sabo, Liba, Squovit, Cabrawler, Garuki, First Hall of Rare, Greedence, and a Dove Trio. Sabo, Liba, Squovit, Cabrawler, Garuki, First Hall of Rare, Golurk, and a Non Hollow Volcarona. Let me know how. Your guys' polls from Chilling Rain have been in the comments below. Um, after this box, I'll probably just end up buying singles to finish my master set because the pull rates are pretty tough. You'd have to open multiple thousands of packs if you're wanting to get anywhere close to a master set because of how many secret rares there are in addition to the alt arts. First Hollow Celio and a non hollow Malamar. Amazing artwork though. Rock rough, shut it. I like the snow there. This almost looks like a uh, like a movie scene or something. I don't know why. Get from the animation. Zeb Strike the boot. I always mention this one. It's one of the top artworks in the set for me. Porygon Grookey. That's cute. Mareep. Rockruff. Versus Hollow Shaman. And a Hollow Greedence. Glaring your mask. Coffin, Shuppet, Squovis, Feel, Ice Rider, Calyrex, sick card, I really like that. First one of that I've pulled. Diglett, Larvesta, Inkay, Rockruff, Ghastly. Oh, 
I thought I thought I saw a full eye for a second. Just an ultra rare. The last box I opened just had six regular V ultra rares and nothing else. So that was really strange. It's just really hard to open full arts from this set. Or seeker rares. I opened one seeker rare in four boxes. Normally in most sets, the average is like one per box. All right. VMAX. Tornadus. All right, I did need this one. Sick. Let's go. Reverse Hollow Spiral Energy. Don't know if that's a playable card or not. Too lazy to read the, the long text box. <laughs> Reminds me of a Yu-Gi-Oh card with that much text. There's Hollow Melanie. I pulled two full art of Melanie. Pretty nice. Sobble reverse and a hollow thunderous. Alright, there's half the box. We got three V's and one V Max. I think the full art rate is like one in fifty packs. Rainbow's like one in a hundred. Gold's also like one in a hundred. So yeah, really, really tough get any of the hits. I feel like that's part of their strategy for this set, just make people have to buy massive amount of packs to get even a single hit. <laughs> I should make the alt arts like in rainbow rares hold a good amount of value though since they're so hard to pull. Definitely better to buy singles from this set. I would not recommend opening packs of Chilling Rain, especially if you're paying like above $100 a box, unless you just really want to have fun with it. <gasps> Let's go. All right, finally we get rewarded. Nice looking glaring rap rapid ash there. Aside from the birds, this might, might have been one of the ones I most wanted to pull. Really beautiful. Print quality is perfect, so that's good. I'm glad they at least got the print quality good on like the the full arts and stuff, since the hollows were all horrendous print quality. Reverse Drizzile, so there we go. Um, this is my fifth booster box of Chilling Rain. And we finally pulled an alternate art. So that's about the average, right? One in 150 or so packs. We opened five boxes. Makes sense. At least I didn't get zero alternate arts. I would have been so depressed. Especially after that last box I opened that just had six normal Vs and nothing else. Lucky Energy and a Celebi V. Ooh, I really like that card. And a Galarian Articuno V. My favorite bird. Let me know who your guys' favorite bird is in the comments down below. Articuno, Moltres, or Zapdos. You can have a different selection for the Galarian versions if you want also. For me, I just like Articuno and Galarian Articuno. 
beautiful pack arts from this set. I really like the box art and the pack art. A Metagross V. Alright, this is a nice box. I mean, we hit the Alt Rapidash. That's pretty much all, all I was looking for. I just wanted to pull one Alt Art and then... Ooh, Galarian Slowking VMAX. I did need this one for my Master Set. Cool, cool. Alright, yeah, this is a lot better than my last box, obviously. Four packs remaining. Fluffy Beedrill. Oh. VMAX Tornadus, another one. All right, last two packs of Chilling Rain that I will be opening for now, because this is my last box to crack. I'll be keeping the last one sealed. Where's Halloween? I might open more in the future, but I'm more than likely just gonna buy the singles, because the, the pull rates in this set are way too tough. What We only got one Seeker Rare out of five boxes. Like, that's just insane. Yeah, there you have it. Galarian Rapidash Alternate Art. Beautiful card. If you enjoyed the video, like, comment, subscribe. Join my Discord in the description. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.